thanks, Jesse, and welcome back into Good Day Live, everyone. Now, we may be living in 2021, but this is the year of 12. 12 Points Revitalization Incorporated is offering the community members the opportunity to be part of some huge changes coming this summer. And today, I've got the VP, Jennifer Mullen Perry, here to tell me all about it. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, nice to meet you. Hi, it's nice to, to meet you, you too. Yeah, thank you thank for coming you. on. Thank you for having I, me. I hope to have you on even more. More. <laughs> <laughs> now, can you tell me and everyone out there what is 12 points in 12 points revitalization incorporated. incorporated so uh it's a nonprofit to revitalize the historic area of the community. For those of you who are from Terre Haute, you probably know that 12 Points is the first city within the city, and there's amazing historic art architecture in that area. And I think we're about the third nonprofit to try, try this out, but we're striking while the iron is hot, and there's so much community support right now to bring this area back to life. Yeah, and what do you guys want to add to that community to kind of, you know, bring some life back into it? Yeah, well, we've been working on this nonprofit for about two years now, but this summer, if we get the funds gathered, there's four things that we want to add to the 12 Points community. It's a One is a big iron archway that says, Welcome to Historic uh, 12 Points. Wi-Fi for the area and Gold Medal Park for the next three or four years for community members to enjoy that. Um, bike racks for people who want to, uh, you know, just ride their bike down the area. And then finally, some new lighting. Um, because I think that just makes the area safer for everybody. Yeah, and, and it, the pictures that you guys have, and I know we've showed some, it looks amazing. Yeah. So the benefit of that has to be just yeah amazing yeah we are so thankful for the renderings um, that came to us for free somebody donated their time um, at Kansas State University to make those for us and so we were partnered with a contractor to get those renderings up and going and those renderings are vital um, to doing this campaign because you need to be able to show your vision so people will um, have a better idea of where the money's going yeah and Jennifer I'll tell you <laughs> Every time we do something, uh, a benefit, a rally, a fundraiser, people in Terre Haute are so supportive. Right. So how much money are you looking to raise for this? Oh my gosh, as much as we can. <laughs> um, but I will say our goal right now, short-term goal, is to raise $50,000 by June 7th. And if we do raise $50,000 by June 7th, it, that money will be matched by the IHCDA, so that is the Indiana Housing and Community Development Authority. Um, and they are so gracious in helping us. And we've gone through some hoops to get that going, And but we are so appreciative. I think hopefully by the end of this week, we'll be halfway toward our goal. Um, Union Hospital has contributed a great amount so far. Brampton Brick has, has uh, contributed a lot. And so have several community members. So we thank you so much um, for believing in this cause as much as we do. Yeah, and not only can people donate because, you know, we want to see that area back up and running and get some life into it. Right. Um, you guys are doing a, a raffle, right? We are doing a very a raffle. interesting raffle. I, with our, <laughs> go to our Facebook page, our 12 Points Revitalization uh, Facebook page. We have events coming up through the whole month, but one of the things that we just started was a meat ticket raffle. Uh, thanks to Crocs Butcher Shop here in Terre Haute and Farmersburg, we have a meat package uh, worth $525. We are selling one ticket for $5 and five tickets for $20. If you're interested, hit us up on Facebook. We will get you those tickets. They are selling like hotcakes because everybody <laughs> loves their meat. And if you do win, you can separate it out or however you want to do. Uh, but the drawing will be June 7th. That is the last day of the campaign at 9 a.m. We'll do a Facebook Live. And I was just about to say, that's not really uh, spreading it out. You, you <laughs> win and you win 500 something dollars. dollars. Of me, make sure you have a, a like a deep freezer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're I have need one. Somewhere to store it. I can store it for you. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Can you tell everyone out there where they can go for more information about the uh, 12 Points Revitalization Incorporated and where they can go to donate? Right. So uh, th where you can go to donate, uh, I will say this: it's www patronicity.com slash year of 12. Uh, we also, I do want to say this, um, we also have a um, year of 12 vendor market coming up on May 12th. So 12 points 12, on 12. the 12. <laughs> From 4 to 8 p.m., we are going to be selling raffle tickets there if you want to come out and do that. Otherwise, you can get a hold of us on our Facebook page. Just look tw up 12 Points Revitalization, Inc. You can't miss us. Send us a message and we'll hook you up with all kinds of tickets. All right, Jennifer's got the hookup, everybody. I do. <laughs> awesome. Thank you so much for being here, Jennifer. Thank I you. I really appreciate it. And Thank like I said, I hope to have us. you on yeah. even more. Yeah. All right, guys, stay right there because we got more Good Day Live when we get back.